You hear the news? The Skullgirl has been going after all those families in Maplecrest. Looks like this new Skullgirl's got a bone to pick with the boss. Where has he gone anyway? Think the rumors of him getting sick are true? Hold up. Look, there she is. The fish folk dame we were sent to find. Hey, girly! Can we get some service over here? Yes? May I help you, sir? Hey, now. You're quite the dish. I'd like to eat you up. Oh, drop that sexy old dude. No, she's... She's young. Now, how about you swim over and fetch me and my buddy here a couple free drinks and then we hit the town. I, I'm sorry, but I need to work. You know, you are pretty cool for a stinking girl, girl. Is everything okay over here? Are these guys bugging you, Minette? Go find yourself a sandbox, kitty. We're just having a friendly chat with a little minnow over here. Leave now or I'll throw you out myself. Can you take a clue, you flea-bitten tar? Clearly you don't know who you're messing with. Oh no. <laughs> oh, did you see that? That stupid cat didn't stand a chance. Oh, that's what you think. What the? Never mind, hurry. We found what we were looking for. Let's get back and tell Vitaly. Man, that's so fucking adorable. Yo, okay, Minette? They didn't hurt you, did they? That was amazing! What would I do without you? Learn to for scaring them off, Nadia. Your next door dinner is on me. <laughs> I'm kidding with that. Actually, I think it's time I make my move and follow them. I've got to catch me a skull girl, and it sounds like mafia goons are the perfect bait to draw her out. Sounds very dangerous. Be careful out there. You're like family to us, you know. Nadia, do you really think the skull heart can bring your friends back? She's so fucking adorable. Holy shit! There's only one way to find out. Going there myself. See you around, Munian, and give my regards to your dad, Minette. Here we go. Fuck a mid. Well, I hit her twice. I, mean, I still hit her, so technically I didn't miss. Oh, fuck you! I was going to get PERFECT! <laughs> BAM! Fuck you!
Well, well, what have we here? That's quite the body you've got there, kitty. Er, uh, sorry, creepy lady, but I'm not interested. <laughs> oh, don't get the wrong idea. I was just admiring your scars. You've been cut clean through several times over. No one can survive that, yet here you are, walking, talking, and shedding. Whatever's animating you could be invaluable to my research. Let's perform an autopsy and see what makes you tick. I underestimated you, but I've seen all that I need to see. And I'm sure the analysis of this blood will prove most enlightening. You just don't stop, do you? Lady Valentine, the skull girl has requested your presence at the cathedral. A nurse and a nun. Ha, huh, where have I heard this joke before? I'll be there soon, Double. Return and let Mary know that I found Lorenzo. His minions lend me right to him. I just had to stop and perform a little experiment on our feline friend here. Very well. Take care, Kitty. We'll have a follow-up visit as soon as these tests come back from the lab. So the Skull Girl is hunting at the Divine Trinity's Grand Cathedral, is she? Never was one for churches, but here I'll make an exception. We'll be back together soon enough, guys. This is... <laughs> let's put an end to this cat and mouse game. Ladies and gentlemen, right, let's do this! Showtime. Get ready, my Come on, do it. Oh no! So this is the Grand Cathedral, eh? Meow, what's a skull girl like you doing in a place like this? She followed me home, Double. Can I keep her? You again? Don't you have an appointment with the Skull Girl? <laughs> Indeed I did, but I'm afraid we've got a scheduling conflict. As it turns out, you've got an appointment on my dis dissection table right about now. Let's not be late or I'll have to get my spray bottle. Anything about the spray bottle. You couldn't beat me before, so what makes you think you can now? Yes, my previous experiment was a failure, but I've got my lab assistant to help me this time around. May the Trinity have mercy on this poor soul. The nun is your lab assistant. Hate to bring it to you, lady, but you're not going to get much science out of this one. Your experiments will have to wait, Valentine. She is a candidate. A candidate, you'd say? Even better. Come on, Kitty. The doctor will see you now. 
The doctor is gonna lose! Oh no! Ow! Oh no! Oh shit! Alright, Skullgirl, you know why I'm here. I do. So no offense, but you're the last thing standing between me and my family, so let's get this show on the road. I too have lost much to the Medici's. Do you not seek vengeance? Wish, just wish such a George really turn out well. I've got to try. The Fishbone Gang raised me, protected me, and taught me everything I know. The least I can do is return the favor. Your instincts are admirable. My wish was also to protect my friends. Look, I'm gonna have to stop you before you get to the we're a lot of like you and I bit. I've come too far to turn around, so it's time to claw that heart out of you. So be it. I hope your wish turns out well. Ugh. This fucking fight. <laughs> so glad I put this on sleepwalk, otherwise we're gonna have to do what Josh fucking did lose four times. He almost lost a fifth time too. But of course he was button mashing when he did Phileas, so Wow! That was close! <gasps> that was close! Alright, this is it.
I I can't do it. I have so many new friends in Little Innsmouth. Terrible as it was, what happened happened and made me who I am today. Changing that would be wrong. That's what the skull heart is for, here for, isn't it? To tempt us into doing the wrong thing. Marie said her wish was similar and look how she turned out. Well, no more. <laughs> A temporary setback. This world will always be cursed by a skull heart, and so it will always be cursed with skull girl. Until this world exists no more. All that for a life lesson? How annoying. Well, better go check in on everyone back in Little Intimuth and get some food. I'm exhausted. Munion, I'm back! I'm starving and claiming that free meal. Bring me the full Lucky Family Banquet. Nordia! There you are! <laughs> Minette has been kidnapped, all the River King's daughters and others too. Little Innsmouth is in a panic. What? Who would dare do such a thing? That's where I come in. My name is Irvin and I'm a private detective. The River King has hired me to find his daughter, so if you have any information that might help me find her, it'd be appreciated. The proprietor of this fine establishment was telling me that there have been numerous mafia sightings in the area recently. That's the only lead we've got, but kidnapping certainly fits the mob's MO. We're at a loss as to why they'd be targeting Dagonian women, though. The mafia, maybe Marie, had it right all along. Irvin, I'm coming with you. Those black-hearted bastards already took one family from me, and like hell I'm going to let them do it again. Hang in there, Minette. We'll find you. Yeah! There we go.